The Prime Minister really expressed in a very clear and convincing way the historic desire of the Israeli people to achieve peace on the basis of a two-state solution, a Palestinian state, independent, demilitarized, but living in honor, in respect, deciding their own destiny, improving their economy. I think the settlements should be agreed, should be part of the agreement. And if the agreement will move quickly, we don't have to have a double negotiations, once before and then during. It's a good beginning. And I would postpone the issue of the settlement for another couple of weeks or three weeks. We have time. We don't have to tackle all the thorny issues. Well, it is not bad for a start, but uh, it must have a substance in it. Uh, the first thing is, and the important thing is, that uh, the contents of peace. The, and peace means a Palestinian, a viable Palestinian state, uh, with its capital in East Jerusalem, and to solve the other problems, in particular the refugee problem. The question of settlements is a key. You cannot build settlement. You know what, 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 what it means. It means change in the demographic composition of the territories and in the geographical character of the territories that are the sub subject of negotiations. So if you continue to change, then the, the duration of the negotiations will be the duration, the sa at the same time, the duration for changing the occupied territories and making the result of negotiations impossible.